Assalam o Alaikum everyone. This is Abdul Samad Anar from Habibi Vlogs. How are you all? I hope everyone is fine and doing great. So today I will be talking about the latest update from Indian Embassy that who wants to return home from Saudi Arabia, United Arab Emirates, and Bahrain. I will also tell you from where you can get the form and how you can fill it. A to Z information you will get throughout my video. So watch this video till the end. Yalla. So welcome back. India opens e-registration for its citizens in GCC who wants to return to home country. Indian citizens in Saudi Arabia who wants to go to India has been called to fill the form online in order to collect their data. However, the embassy of India said no decision has been taken yet regarding resumption of flights to India. The embassy will make an announcement about it soon. The decision is taken by the Indian government on this regard. The Indian embassy claims that the purpose of the form is to collect information only. One submission for one person for each family member separate form to be filled. Once this form is submitted, there is no need to send any further email to embassy in this regard. Interested people can fill this form with this link. This link that I have shown you here, I will give you the link in the description so you can click it and get to it directly. So after going on the link, don't forget to prepare with all these things before you submit it online full name as in passport age in years gender passport number passport valid or not expiry date of passport visa type of saudi arabia ikama number if available if ikama available do you have exit visa reason for repatriation to india choose any student professional worker tourist visitor deportee amnesty dependent family member city in saudi arabia nearest international airport state name of india address in india nearest international airport to home in India email address contact number in Saudi Arabia contact number in India took virus test profession or skill remarks undertaking embassy of India Riyadh sub consent form for repatriation from Saudi Arabia I hereby my willingness to return to India in accordance with the terms of the embassy I confirm my readiness to follow all instructions given by the officials of government of India embassy of India aircraft crew medical personnel on arrival. I agree to bear the applicable airfare that will be charged by the airline concerned. I agree to undergo a 14 days mandatory quarantine on my arrival in India at my own expense as per the protocols framed by the government of India. Agree with the terms. So for the Indians living in UAE and Bahrain, you have to apply these same steps and follow the same steps as I told you before in applying of Saudi Arabia form. I will provide you the link in the description. Click the link and fill the form. That's all for today and I want to tell you some important points that you have to keep in mind. Don't be in a hurry. Read it carefully before applying it. The embassy said no decision has been taken yet regarding resumption of flights to India. The embassy will make an announcement about it soon once the decision is taken by the Indian government on this regard. I hope this information was helpful for you and if you want more updates regarding to it so don't forget to subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification bell so whenever I will upload my video you will get the notification every time. Give me permission to leave now so this is Abdul Samad Anwar from Habibi Vlogs signing off.